Hey guys, so today we're going to be looking at my picks for the top 5 LEGO Star Wars sets of 2008. If you have any suggestions for sets you like from 2009 or any other year, please comment them down below. And I also hope that you like the new style and intro. Um, and without further ado, let's get into it. fifth place we have the 7674 V19 turret um, and this was a pretty good set I'm gonna say um, it's just a really cool vehicle the only thing holding it back is of course the exception of this studs on one side thing which is a problem that Lego has um, they had this problem with the Mandalorian fighter but other than that I think it's a really good set other than also the canopy being exposed but yeah, it is a pretty great set, and yeah, it could definitely be higher on the list, but there are a few, few flaws, um, and just the other ones are better. In fourth place, we have a tie between the two battle packs released this year, the Imperial one and the Rebel Dropship. These were both really amazing battle packs, and they really need a remake. Um, they're like the best original trilogy battle packs I think you could ask for. Um, and if we had battle packs like this with just four standard troopers, or in case of the Imperial, the three stormtroopers and one shadow trooper, obviously that one got a remake in 2019, but that was a bit overpriced. So yeah, these ones are very good sets, and I wish that they would both get a, another remake. Up next is the ATT from this year, and this is actually an incredible set, and it's obviously only just taken down by the 2013 one, but this is obviously the second best ATT ever made, and it still holds up today. In second place we have the amazing 2008 Republic Gunship set. This is honestly incredible, and I just really love this set with an amazing array of minifigures. And the only thing to top that would be the 2013 gunship, and soon to be the UCS one. Uh, but come on, Plo Koon, Obi Wan, Aside for Interest, Cody, and a clone, amazing minifigure selection, and just an amazing build on its own. We can't do a top 5 list without naming probably the most popular LEGO Star Wars set, maybe even LEGO set ever. This is the 2008 Death Star, and honestly 2016 one's slightly better, but it was a lot more overpriced. So this one is the, the OG, the incredible on its own, and I mean it's just great. It's like the best playset ever, I think. Display wise, it can look cool, I think a lot of people say that it's bad but I've seen some good ways to display it and especially if you get it on like a turntable and you can see all around it it's just quite a cool display piece um, but yeah that is all of the uh, all of my top five picks for sets 2008 um, so yeah let me know down below what your favorite sets from this year are and if you have any favorite sets from 2009 you want to Put on obviously i'll be putting on the public dropship and atot um but yeah any other sets just comment them down below and yeah okay that'll be all for today i hope you've enjoyed this video please remember to like and subscribe that'll be all folks goodbye